you will have a lot of different pages and posts on your website. And certain of the page or certain of the posts, you don't want to make it public to every single one, but only cater to a dedicated group of people. How are you able to do that? Hey guys, this is Zavin from DMZ. In this video, I'll be sharing with you how you can actually create a password protected page or post on your WordPress website so that that particular page is not going to open public to every single one, but it's only catered to a dedicated group of persons who having your password to actually unlock the page. So if you would like to create a um, password protected page, right, this is basically the difference. So uh, whenever that a user is going to your website, you know, this um, the, the website is basically on public, right? Um, they can just click on all the other pages that you have, you know, then, um, you know, they will just go into your product pages and stuff like that. And everything's all the pages is actually, uh, you know, public. But some of you guys will be thinking of like certain of the page information, uh, perhaps you will actually would like to do it in into a password protected page so that when you give this link to your users, you know, a specific category of users, they have to type in a password in order for them to unlock that page in order for them to view um, the website, okay, in order for them to view the website. For example, if let's say today I'm going to lock a product B, okay? Let's say this is my page, right? Product B, okay? And I don't want any one of them to actually see my product B page. And I just want to lock it with password protected uh, passwords, uh, you know, so, and, and when the moment that they come to this page, you will actually prompt them to enter the password. Then only they can actually unlock and see the content on this page. So how do I do this, okay? First of all, you need to make sure that you come to this page and we're going to edit this page. Yeah? So I'm going to see, let you see the difference of right here. We're going to click under the edit page and it will bring you to the uh, WordPress editors, right? Straightforward, very easy. On the right-hand side over right here, you can see that under this publish, you'll be able to see there's visibility right there. Okay, click under the edit. That's where you'll be able to change um, the settings, yeah? So we have three types of settings over right here. We have public, password protected, and also we have private, okay? So public is any one of us also can view. Um, doesn't matter who, whoever coming to your website, anyone can see your content. Pro password protected, it simply means that only users um, with the password. So when they come to that page, um, it will be locked and um, they will need to enter the password in order for them to lock in, okay? Private, it means that uh, it's only you yourself can see, okay? So it's only you yourself as the admin of this website, you will be able to see the page if you're logging in as a admin access from there. So now we are going to change it to password protected and this is where you're just going to type in or um, you know write that, right? So uh, straightforward, is, let's say I'm just going to use, uh, you, you just need to set a password, right? So uh, my case, I'm going to set it as Zavin Gray, <laughs> my name as my password, okay? Right after you set a password, you just go ahead and click on OK. And you can see that the visibility has been changed to password protected. And you just go ahead and click on update. Okay. So right after you update, you'll just come to your product B page and then you just view a new page. Okay. So you can see from here, other than just the title, it looks a bit messy yeah, because of the theme that I'm using. If you can see from here, it actually says that this content is password protected. If you want to view, okay, you need to type in your password right here. So what I'm going to do is that down here, okay, under this this password over this section, because I'm using a you know a image background, so this image background is a bit annoying. So that's why you can't really see my text right here, yeah. But this is the one that I highlighted to you. You can see that this content is password protected. To view it, you actually need to enter your password below, right? So that's a field for you to enter the password, and there's an enter um you know icons right there. So my password is actually Zavin Gui, right? So I'm going to type in Zavin Gui, um, you know, the password, and you hit on enter, this is what is going to happen, yeah? You hit on enter, and you are just able to, you know, to bring you to a um, page that has been unlocked, okay? So, you know, in terms of your passwords, everything, it will be basically just unlocked from there. Okay, so you will be able to view the content. So this is how you're going to do the setting of a password protected uh, uh, page. Yeah, very easy, very simple. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, remember to leave your comment below. How is like and share? 
If you are yet to subscribe to our YouTube channel, remember to click on the subscribe button and most importantly, hit on the bell icon so that you'll be able to receive notifications when we launch our new video. See you in the next video. Thank you.